Well, it sure was a warm one out there today. In fact, it was a record warm day for December 22nd, a high of 83 degrees, beating the old record of 82 just a couple of years ago on this date in uh, 2011. Here's a look at our current numbers. We're still 71 degrees in Savannah. It gets cool when you get west of Macon. That's where a cold front is. You've got 50s from Columbus to Athens to Atlanta, and that cool air will start to head our way, especially tomorrow evening. Right now, it's fairly dry across the area. Now, we have seen a couple spotty little brief showers. One has been moving up from uh, Keller to Savannah and will also affecting areas just west of Hardyville that will continue to push north. So you may get some brief rain here in the low country here. Last maybe about 10 or 15 minutes, but the main rain area is out to our west. We're raining pretty hard around Atlanta. Even a little bit of thunder spots moving over towards Macon. Now this uh, initial batch of showers and thunder will weaken as we head through the night and then a weaker band of showers will push through our area tomorrow. Here's a look at the latest model showing this area of heavy rain kind of falling apart overnight, but we'll still have some shower chances through the day, especially in the afternoon along the coastal counties. Some of the western areas like Vidalia, Statesboro, Sylvania, you may have a better chance of seeing some rain in the morning. This will all clear out for your Christmas Eve. Christmas Day also looking mostly sunny. At the same time, it is going to be turning colder. Right now, it's very warm. Temperatures around 70. In fact, it's 63 all the way up to New York City. But look what's behind this cold front. We've got some frigid air. 10 degrees in Minneapolis, minus 14 up in Bismarck, North Dakota. Now, we're not going to get anywhere near that cold, but a piece of this cold air is going to head south and will give us some chilly weather as we head through Christmas and the end of the week. 65 in the morning, though, pretty warm and mostly cloudy. As the day goes on from west to east, we'll have increasing chances for some showers. Look for an average high of 72. High tide occurring here in just a few minutes. Next one will occur tomorrow morning at 1137. Meanwhile, the water will have a southwest wind tomorrow, and that goes to the northwest on Tuesday as colder air starts to push on in. Here's a look at your latest pollen report. Mold is moderate. Weed pollen and tree pollen are both low. And your storm tracker, seven day forecast, has that rain off and on tomorrow, and then the high down to 60 on Tuesday. Going to be chilly for Christmas with a high of 56. Morning lows will be down close to freezing. And then we may have more clouds and sun to finish out the week in seasonably cool conditions.